in the next few points. Um, and so having that positive reinforcement, knowing that your partner is not going to get upset for you going for a shot and missing it, I think is, is really helpful. Welcome to Pickleball Therapy. This is the podcast dedicated to your pickleball improvement. Think about it in terms of pre-play, right? So the, the phase before you, before you step out onto the court, the phase while you're playing the game, and then the phase after you play the game. Maybe it's a better world if we give them the benefit of the doubt rather than going to, well, you're just an a-hole. At Pickleball Therapy, it's all about helping you achieve your pickleball goals with a focus on the mental part of your game. What might be helpful to you is to think about the game as having two parts, and more specifically, you as a player as having two different sides to your game. One side is how well can you withstand stress? Together, we can forge a stronger relationship with pickleball with the added benefit of playing better as well. You want to take a custom approach to your improvement. It's not a one size fits all. For instance, a video that you see on YouTube that says, you know, these five tips are what you need. Do you? Are those the five tips you need? No matter what your objectives are in your pickleball journey, pickleball therapy is here to encourage and support you. Our mission is to share with you a positive and healthier way of engaging with the sport that you love. So don't practice, you know, 82 different shots, a little bit here, a little bit there, and not be very good at any of them. Practice the three shots I just mentioned, if you want to use those, and become very good at those three shots. And you'll be amazed at how well you can yeah, play. Do you mind sharing those stats that you shared with us about the uh, the net and the uh, percentages of winning? The team that hit fewer volleys into the net during that entire match, which could be three games up to five games, that team won 72% of those gold medal matches. Tune in weekly on Apple, Spotify, YouTube, or anywhere you listen to podcasts. New episodes drop every Friday. Lots of inputs because there's a lot of different things that happen in a game. A game is actually, if you think about it, a game is a series of rallies that some are in your favor, some are not in your favor. And then at the end of the contest, uh, at some stage, you know, one of us reaches 11 and that's the end of the, of the game. I look forward to joining you inside our next episode of the Pickleball Therapy Podcast. I'll see you then.